uh, I'm handling some business right now. I want y'all to hop in and ride with me real fast. So I'm going over here to handle some business at a car dealership. I thought about you guys because a lot of you are looking for employment once you get to Arizona. If I didn't tell y'all about the opportunity at car dealerships, I would be doing you guys a disservice. Car business in Arizona is humongous. I want you to take a look at this area. This is uh, what we call uh, autoplex, auto centers. It's basically an area that has a bunch. Look at this, look at this, while I'm talking, look. None rehearsed, none rehearsed. Can y'all see that? Uh, I don't know if y'all can see it. You see that? Not rehearsed, guys. I swear I didn't even know that was right there. If I didn't tell y'all about the opportunity uh, in car dealerships, I'd be doing y'all a disservice. When I first moved out here, first, my second job that I caught was at a car dealership. And I ended up working for car dealerships for the next two, three years, having never worked at a car dealership before. I went on to purchase a home off of my earnings from a car dealership. I went on to purchase vehicles. You know, uh, working at a car dealership, you get first dibs on vehicles that come in on trade and stuff like that. So you always getting a good deal. You paying dang near what the dealership paying for cars. And they always hooking you up because they got all the relationship with the banks. As far as like, you know, the banks doing the financing on uh, doing a financing for cars. Here's the thing I want you to keep in mind with a car dealership. When people think of car dealerships, mostly or a lot of the times what they think of is car salesmen. But a car salesman really is just one position at a car dealership. There are so many positions in a car dealership. I want you to think about this. This is, this is all that's at a car dealership. And there's more positions than what I'm gonna tell you. There's of course salespeople. There's people that, that work all in the sales department, which are like desk managers. There's the finance uh, guys. Those are the people that uh, get you finance for your car or work out the financing for your car, sell you the warranties and stuff. There's the service department. Service department helps people with their oil changes. They're the one to set you up or set you up with your appointment to do an oil change. Any type of service done to your vehicle, repair done to your vehicle, those are people that are in the service department. Also, you have people that is, that's in the parts department. You have people that uh, do transportation, that's transporting parts back and forth to different stores. You have people that work in the detailing department. All of those vehicles have to get detailed, washed and detailed. They got people that take care of the accessories. Those are like grills, rims, tires, you know, basically different upgrades done to the vehicle. There's people that are in, um, we call it, we used to call it the business development department or the BD, BDC, business development center. What they would do is make phone calls. So they would make phone calls, uh, set up appointments for people to come in for sales to purchase a vehicle. There's even security at car dealerships that basically make sure that cars aren't getting stolen. What I'm trying to tell you is that when you see a big outfit, one thing about, here go think about Arizona. You see like this auto mall, all of these car dealerships right here. Each car dealership has all these positions. There's the receptionist. <laughs> each car dealership has all of these positions and more. Like I'm not even, there's cleaning, people have to clean up there. Uh, you know, detailing, wash cars. Uh, there's lot, 
they call them lot boys. What lot boys do is move around cars. You might have to take a trade in the back. You have to pull up cars when the car gets sold. Um, you have to go get vehicles, a service vehicle. So if a person comes there to pick up their vehicle for service, the, the lot attendant, they go and pick up the vehicle, bring it up front for them. There's so many positions there. Um, what I want you to keep in mind is that all at every dealership there is all of these positions available and more like I don't I don't I'm not giving you all the positions that they hire for in Arizona in these in Phoenix and its surrounding in the suburbs there are so many auto malls like there are a ton of them. so if you live in surprise there's an auto mall if you live in Arrowhead, there's an auto mall. If you live in Avondale, there's an auto mall. Wherever you're at, there's an auto mall nearby. Every single dealership in the auto mall needs these jobs filled. So I want you guys, I just wanted to let you guys know about the automotive industry because the automotive industry is big time. It's thriving out here like crazy. Everybody has to have a car in Arizona. It's 110 degrees. It's 114 degrees right now. You cannot be outside traveling all over the valley without a vehicle. So uh, the car business is big, it's always been big. Uh, just to speak on the sales position, you could start in the sales position and end up in six figures, making a six figure income in the car business within two to three years. I mean, going from a salesperson to an assistant manager, from assistant manager to finance or to the desk is doable in the car industry and it's a business that will hire you they're lenient on felons and and you can they will give you a shoe in they will let you in that door all right so this is your man big super over now man like this video share this video subscribe to the channel peace